That's one of the little things that's gonna annoy Julian at sure. I tend to be careless. Anyway. So I'd like to <laughs> I'd, I'd like to uh, say something to my parents. Okay. Uh, first to my dad. No. Uh, uh, I did. First to both of you. Um, I think I was supposed to do this earlier on, but uh, there was no time these past couple of days. I was supposed to do some do this this morning, but uh, I guess tama lang din that I say this to uh, everyone here. You know, that pa, ma, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sa lahat ng nagawa ko that hurt you. Sa lahat ng uh, nagawa niyo para sa akin, kung paano niyo ako pinalaki, you deserve absolutely none of that. And uh, thank you na despite Everything. Nandiyan kayo. Hindi kayo napapagod sa akin. Or kahit kanino sa aming magkakapatid, no? My mom, you know, you're now uh, ripe age of uh, 38. Yeah. Uh, 30. No. Uh, just wanted to say na at your age, in this wedding, still, he contributed the most effort, lahat, no? Uh, I thought I could do it on my own, no? Thank you for knocking sense into me that I can't. Thank you for helping me anyway. I make so many mistakes and, uh, hindi na po kayo yung ako nun, si Julian, in the future. Uh... <laughs> Anyway, I want to start with you first, Pa. Uh, my dad, uh, I can tell you about, about him, no? Uh, this is not often said, no? But uh, I want to brag about my family, no? Just a little bit. You know, um, for just to keep things short, you know, um, not a lot of people here know, or some people know, but you know, uh, my, my dad is not my biological father. But never once did I feel that in my 30 years of being with you, pa. Not once. The feeling na kami, na, kami ni Kuya, that you were loved completely. You know, pinag-drive mo kami araw-araw. I still remember as a kid uh, that pag-drive mo kami araw-araw kasi nga gusto mo safe kami. Ni mo dinelegate sa driver, even though you could have. Pag tinatanong ka, anong trabaho mo? Sabi mo, ikaw yung driver at saka tutor namin. No? Pag tinanong ka, teka lang, di ba lawyer ka? Sabihin mo, hindi, side ko lang yun. Sideline, no? <laughs> because my, my dad put us first. He put family first. And uh, in that sense, uh, to have... This kid in front of you, pa, ako, di na ako kid ngayon, no? And to take care of me the way you did, ikaw ang pinaka-example of Jesus in my life. I want to tell you that, no? Um, I am, I just want to tell everyone here that I am very proud of my dad. He's the best dad in the world, no? And, uh, thank you, pa. It would be very different today. Kung, uh, kung wala ka, Pap. Yeah. And, uh, thank you, Pap. No, love you, Pap. And, uh, no, now, ma, no, alam mo, uh, my mom is like my duplicate, no? Ginawa mo lang, older by five years, di ba? Uh, and, uh, you know, very energetic, ganun din. Very, uh, sometimes, workaholic. Sometimes lang, di ba? Okay, sometimes. Yeah. Um, 
I, I know, I realize now that kung nagkaroon man kami ng conflict growing up, it was because we were so the same. Dahil magkaparehas tayo ma. No? Kaya nga siguro ni mama, kumuha ka ng something like, some, someone like your dad, no? Parang ganun, and uh, yeah, and then siya. Um, my mom is just an incredible person. She's the kind of person na pag nilagay mo yung buhay niya in a biography, it would be one of the most inspiring stories that you could ever read, no? And she's very humble about it. That's why ngayon ko gusto sabihin, no? If my dad is the greatest dad, my mom is the greatest greatest mom, no? And uh, I just want to tell you, ma, that I want to learn more from you, pa. So, for uh, kahit kasal na ako ngayon, how to be you po. <laughs> Because uh, if, if, if anyone's going to be an example as to how I should live moving forward, it's going to be my mom. So yun po, I love you ma. No? Uh, don't worry, dito pa rin ako, dun pa rin ako kakain sa Saviorville, pagtanghalian, pagbaunin nyo na po ako. Thank you.